Hey everybody, welcome back to RC with Adam. My name is Adam, you know that. I'm out here in the field flying, having a great time, beautiful day. But I just wanna let you guys know, in case you're not aware, this cable right here is very important and something that you may wanna consider uh, getting one of because that is a on-the-go cable or an OTG cable. Why this is so great is because this allows you to connect to items that you wouldn't normally be able to connect your phone to. For example, here I'm copying files from the Insta360 Go 2, which I actually really hate. This is partly why, and I can uh, copy those files to my phone directly, and I don't have to deal with the Insta360 app. It's a terrible app. It's very unreliable and all that stuff. That's why one of these cables is so important. Or if you wanna plug it into a quadcopter, you can plug it into the flight controller. It's, well, this is plugged up right now, but you can see there's a flight controller there. So you could plug it into the flight controller and access beta flight settings. Um, and my preferred way of doing that is with the Speedy Bee app. So a little bonus tip there. I'll probably make a video about the Speedy Bee app just to get the information out there. So what I have is for USB-C and it goes to a USB-A or like the big USB. And then from there I can use regular like USB-C or micro USB cables. If you look up like, you know, USB-C to USB-C OTG cable or USB-C to USB-A or whatever, uh, OTG cable or on-the-go cable, that's what you'll find. And this particular one is a JSAUX brand. I have no idea how that's pronounced. I don't know how they come up with these brand names. It's pretty ridiculous. Uh, just, just so, just so. I don't know what's silent and what's not. I mean, mostly it's for connecting to your quadcopter, but you could connect other things. I don't know if you can connect to a GoPro, like to get the files directly from the GoPro. Bonus tip, another really great thing to have. Speaking of uh, transferring media files from your awesome flight footage, this right here is a little USB SD card adapter. The point of this card adapter is so that you can take your video from your GoPro or your uh, DVR or whatever and put it on your phone as kind of a backup. Um, and then from your phone, you could put them on your computer or you could put them on an external hard drive or something like that. So really handy little device for offloading SD cards and uh, making backups and stuff. And you can connect it to either uh, USB-C on this side or USB-A, the big, the big kind of USB on that side. And this is really great because it has a little slot for a micro SD card, which is like what you use in your GoPro or your, um, well, almost everything, but or your GoPro or your uh, DJI Air unit or your goggle DVR, or you can use the regular size SD cards um, like for your larger cameras or something like that. Uh, right now I have an SD to micro SD adapter in here actually. So if you find one that doesn't have the option to you do the micro SD, then uh, you can use an SD to micro SD adapter card. And this is just like a, it's like a memory card that just isn't, it's just a fake memory card basically. And it's, it's just a little adapter. So you can put little micro US, uh, micro SD cards in there. So just another little bonus tip for uh, transferring files out in the field. Very, very helpful. All right, thanks for watching. Get out there and fly something. We'll get, I mean, we get bars, we get our goggles.